it is no secret that AIs are making waves within the content creator industry. Whether it be your trusty pal, ChatGPT, the non-controversial TV broadcast, Watch Me Forever, and everyone's favorite, AI art. Th this is a joke. And nevertheless, there are plenty eyes on the subject, but I want to see if an AI could actually become a streamer. The closest thing we have to this so far is VTubers, but even then, there is still a person behind that screen, the robot, the... At least I, <clears throat> at least I hope so. So I decided to use ChatGPT to respond back to all my chat's messages during an ordinary Mario Kart stream. However, there is an issue. If people know they are talking to an AI, they will directly start talking differently to it, asking ludicrous questions like, will we ever have world peace? <laughs> <laughs> Why is it taking so long to answer? <laughs> to get past this, I secretly had my friend JG5 in a Discord call telling me every single response ChatBT makes to my viewers' messages. Welcome racers and gaming enthusiasts! Get ready to rev your engines and take to the track on our Mario Kart stream! Whether you're a seasoned player or just a getting started, we're excited to bring you some high speed, adrenaline fueled action, so buckle up and get ready to race with us. Okay, this is a believable and strong intro. Now I'll have to figure out how to talk to chat. Orange Yoshi and Dragon Balls are, are both great choices. Orange Yoshi is known for like his high speed and maneuverability, while Dry Bones' weight is, or, or Dry Bowser's weight is handling, make, uh, make him a kind of a formidable opponent at times. <clears throat> Which tracks do you enjoy the most in so far? <laughs> okay, I could probably learn how to become a better reader because I keep stumbling on my words, but it's okay because they still believe it anyway. All right, 3DS, Rainbow Road, and Riverside Park are fun ones. Yeah, those are both great tracks. 3DS Rainbow Road is definitely a challenging but uh, exciting course. What's this twist and turns? So I know I said before, reading chat while playing Mario Kart is one of my greatest skill sets, and it was time to see how I could put this to the test and if I can get away with it. I'll be invading soon. I'm not sure what you mean by invading soon. Could you please provide like, some more content for that? Game audio is loud. There we go. I mean, another option could be you could just adjust your, you know, your volume levels. A different audio source. Uh, sometimes the most enjoyable watch longs are the terrible movies. Uh, that's definitely true. Watching a terrible movie with, with friends or, or, or during a, a watch along can be a, a lot of fun. Is single coin still the best item? I'm be honest. I mean, in Mario Kart, there is no best item. There is no best item. A single coin can be held for like in the bright moment and actually protect you from getting your items snagged. So, therefore, I believe it is the best item. Lightning and blue shell. Uh, lightning and blue shell. Are, uh, I mean, they're both powerful items in Mario Kart, but they have their you know their different purposes. Surprisingly, the AI was keeping up with us fairly well. Honestly, I was just shook that it even knew what essentially the new Mario Kart did. Also, did I watch Collision at all? Collision, as in like the Smash Bros. tournament. Okay, maybe questions like that, like Smash Bros. tournaments, won't, won't work out too well. Ah. All my Mario Kart opinions come from watching your stream. <laughs> I, I, I have nothing to say, but I mean, man, thanks for tuning in on my Mario Kart streams. I mean, I'm glad you got, you got all my gameplay commentary is kind of helpful for you, though. You know, it's a good Smash tournament when you when you show a non-Smash or any similar type of video game friends that they're, they're super interested and impressed. <laughs> I mean, it's always great to see different people from different backgrounds and, and, and cultures and, and experiences to come together and enjoy like just one game. So you're probably noticing a trend right now, and I do too. The AI is overly optimistic. Like, I, I would never respond like that. I don't think, I think 98% of streamers wouldn't respond like that. They'd be like, oh yeah, it's really cool that you, we can all come together, but they wouldn't go all deep, uh, like, just like the AI would. No one likes a super nice person. Sometimes everyone likes to see a, a, an angry reaction out of you or some frustration. Oh yeah, we got first! Let's go, guys! Woo! And this probably brings another point to why AIs couldn't be streamers. Would you ever consider, would you ever consider doing a snack tier ranking? Hmm. Mm, yeah, I would consider doing a snack tier ranking. Honestly, I would uh, I would love to do one over Pop Tarts or maybe over cookies. So yeah, that error happens a couple of times, which brings me to my next point is the AI isn't up to date on everything. AIs can be lacking within three to five years of knowledge and with the world rapidly getting 
faster and faster of technology, it's a little bit harsh for it. But that's the cool thing about it also too. It's rapidly getting faster and faster, which means the AI will improve over time. And by the time, fast as we know it, it could be on modern days with all the memes we know and, 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 and everything that's happening in politics and such. It comes with block on it, but I didn't like the, uh, it the first couple of times. Honestly, some people love it, some people don't. It all matters about preference. That's, really, that's pretty impressive. Being bilingual or, mul or multilingual is, is, is this valuable skill, and it's, it's great that, uh, I mean, it was great that you were able to develop some skills like that. And I mean, plus, testing out of it sounds pretty good also. It's better for yourself, and you save yourself a lot of money and time. I think one of the cool things is that even though it's overly optimistic, it does feel nice to be appreciated just a little bit. Okay, the easiest way I've found to post links in the live chat without disabling all chat filters is just to approve every user we trust individually. Yeah, I would not recommend manually approving individual users to post links in the live chat. I don't know, it could be kind of time consuming and potentially risky if you accidentally, you know, let's say, let's say someone turned on me. <laughs> but I, I, I mean, I trust all of you guys, but still. Although, wait, wait, use deep learning AI instead of regular machine translation, although chat GPT is also starting to get good. It is starting to get good. Thanks, uh, thanks for the compliment. Yep, that's a smug face of someone who knows they got away with it. After two hours of playing, I decided to let my viewers in on my little secret. So today, guys, I ran a little experiment. I had James in the background doing, well, let me show you, chat GPT. So I want to check and see if I could successfully sh respond to every one of you guys' messages with ChatGPT. And as much as it was hard and I read response was great, James, show them real quick. I thought it was a pretty interesting uh, stream to try out real quick. And I want to do it in a stream where I know I could both focus on in Mario Kart and also uh, listen to James in my ear. And it was kind of weird because a lot of my responses were super, empath were super sympathetic and really positive. And that's not me all the time. Can 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 AIs become streamers? And the consensus is it would be very difficult. You guys didn't notice anything different. I have a secret. I was also using ChatGPT. Oh, of course you were. <laughs> oh, you were also using ChatGPT. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. I seem especially <laughs> interested in your roll your rolled tacos. Your rolled tacos did seem pretty interesting, and it actually did make me hungry in real life. I, I thought the day, the day giveaway was me trying to read the chat. You know I can't read. <laughs> You know I can't read, I thought me stumbling on my words would have been pretty obvious. So there you have it. My thoughts are AIs just can't be streamers right now, but they like its excitement and also just being entertaining in general. You know I'm a little offended that my chat didn't recognize that I was being a robot. I still had the fun at the end of the day tricking them. And if you want to try this or if you want to see more content just like this, be sure to subscribe to the channel.